for joining us. Thank you, Comrade Influencer, has finally come out to uh, tell the masses the way the whole situation is, telling us that what all Grand Prix Group are facing, it, they cost it to, the, to themselves. They are the reason why the masses are suffering, and they were the one that projected all UAAG grants to the masses, and they are pulling out, and they were the people that projected it for everybody to subscribe and borrow them the money they demanded. Pay attention to this clear message concerning the consequence that will come thereafter if there's no money. Don't forget today is the D-Day that UAAG will be invited to uh, human rights to uh, explain themselves whether there's money or not. Listen to this clear message analysis concerning the happening right now. Good news live update. Stay tuned. I say good afternoon to you all, the subscribers and grant um, community. It's been a long while you hear my voice because I've come to the understanding that I don't need to be making and continuous some um, voice notes. Like before, I don't make unnecessary voice notes. I make voice notes when it's worth it. So I said long time and good afternoon to you all once again. I am comrade influencer. So um today I just want to talk on some things that have called for my attention, but then again I had to wait till um it is more clearer and it is worth it. Um for the um Hula Balo or the playground battle happening between um UAG, their foot soldiers, and um, AGPGN. Um, for today, I am not actually feeling um, pity. I don't have pity for AGPGN because they brought this upon themselves. This is what happens when you breed and feed a hyena. Like what happened when you breed and feed a hyena? It bites you in the end, even if it did not kiss you. So, after it's come of age, so I don't have pity for them because they can't tell, uh, they can't tell me wholeheartedly and sincerely that they didn't know what they were breathing. They know what they were breathing because the past experience tells it all. So if they still decide to harbor someone of that nature, <laughs> so I don't see any reason why I should have pity for them today. So, but I will start from um, Ustaz Dawood. Ustaz Dawood, you had a gift, but you use it to help establish an evil and evil. And help it to root um to dig to root um to, to root very deep into the soil. I don't think um I know that sometimes you come out and still disagree and say one or two, but then again, I don't think any of you can have complaint today in what is happening between UAG and AGPGN because it is all your makings you guys actually breed this and then again this breed you guys breed has grown up and then again it is time to bite back and you know there are differences between um animal you can keep at home and the one that are meant to stay in the forest so if you decide to make the one um, that's supposed to stay in the forest to stay with you at home and the one that's supposed to stay with you at home to stay in the forest. I bet you had already prepared for the repercussion. So 
if you guys did not see this beforehand <laughs> i can have no pity for any of you why because the masses you guys were supposed to stand with we from onset you guys were not standing with them you guys rather decides to side with what is who and and whom whom are not supposed to be at home then the one that's supposed to be at home you guys try to push them to the forest the examples i give here the masses are the ones that are supposed to stay at home why the other gangs are the ones who are supposed to be on the forest but then again you guys decide otherwise so i could still remember the time of mamazi this is where i'm picking from and others who starts that would how do you know can you still remember how many times you've come out to castigate and rubbish Mama Z's, Ma, Ma, madame z's reputation and person despite that you know quite well what was happening was wrong but then again you decided to turn a deaf eye then support whom who you want to support why what was happening should i say it's because the interest was the same then anyways i won't go for that so that i will not uh, make um, this um, voice note lengthy what agpgn are facing today they are not the first set of people to start facing those challenges but they never saw anything wrong with it they saw it as normal until it comes to them just like a mirage on the sandy desert which man took for water until it woke up to it so the fighters or should i say the agitators that from onset before now talked about uaag and what they were doing as not right agpgn you guys were part of the club that comes out logically to start to maybe try to bring it down burn it down burn the truth down whereas the truth can never be the truth can never die irrespective of however you try to click on it however you try to push it and whatever you trust at it it will always be alive so you guys need a lot of apology to be to make for those people you have actually um, throw a bastons at because of same uaag and until then you guys cannot be considered virtuous being until you guys do the needful so that's for that aspect because i could still remember you guys have come against uh, a lot of fighters that were that dares to stand for the truth that dares for st to stand for the truth <laughs> good there are some things now i don't want to go because it's not every information is not for the public so there are some things i'm trying to i'm trying to hold till the right time comes but i just want to make everyone understand this both those who this who decide to stay with fake ones and then um, do what is wrong just in the name of selfish interest being that you belongs to uag or agpgn or others i repeat or others who find this mean as necessary to actually um camp in between those party and outside party to start taking their own avenue to extort the masses the time will come the day will break but that day is coming so for now i'll still keep quiet um so whatever agpgn are facing now they deserves it you guys actually you guys actually shot yourselves on the foot by your own makings and your own decisions so having said all those this i listened to akn and um some this ego and everything or should i say last week and everything he said 
he said he's a man of peace that is virtually very funny a man of peace <laughs> oh god people say when they talk they, they feel like everybody is um you know every, we are all fools no problem but then again i can i could still remember that madam humanitarians once in the past said she when he was this when she was discussing with ocg said told ocg during the voice note that leaked at that time that she actually sent a voice note to you then again when he's before she sent it to the public you are a man of peace but she never had had her back you allow her to send that voice note to the public which later caused an issue no problem you are still a man of peace so you are a man of peace that actually sent OSIM voice note to a platform, but immediately you see that um, Ustaz Dawood came into the group, you deleted it. And that OSIM voice note was not a peaceful one. It was actually a voice note criticizing others that uh, which which criticizing others and talking down on others, which might logically or can logically brought an issue. Yet you were the one that shared it until you saw that Ustaz Dawood came to the platform then you deleted yet you are still a man of peace <laughs> you people say you sometimes when you guys talk i need i think you guys need to hold um your hold your dictionary so that when you are talking or you are describing something you look at the definition first before you fight you find it worthy to put yourself in such um, a definition and um, you know crown <laughs> this is actually very funny when you guys are talking you guys i just wonder sometimes when you guys talk don't you do you even think or you just come to the public and see whatever comes from your your mind okay so for everything apostle ken said in that meeting it is quite clear that he said all those thoughts because he was trying to please and impress someone to see him as good i didn't know who those people might someone or people i don't know who those people might be but then again let me say something again apostle ken do you still remember that admin ellis said you instructed him to do v note against warachuku do you not have you forgotten so soon <laughs> God. And yet, you are still a man of peace. You are a man of peace. Do you mean you are a man of peace that comes to the public and acts as a man of peace? But when you are with people, you instigate some persons against the other. Is that the kind of peace? Because you even know the, the, the definition of a friend, or should I say, no, sorry, a definition of an enemy and frenemy. Do you know a frenemy is worse than an enemy? You are very funny if you said you are a man of peace. You're a man of peace, my foot. Anyways, I as well during this time listening to Bishop T. Ambara. That one has actually virtually um, come to disgrace himself. So I don't have actually I don't have words for him because it is quite clear that um he's, he's he has disgraced himself in grand community. So talking about him or giving him too much attention is will make him relevant whereas he isn't because it's quite clear from the spell he said he's blah blah he was swearing on people and all that imagine he hope a um, bishop for that matter it's really a pity the bishop that say in the past that he's, he, he has quit to and all that people have actually been very funny but it is we will not nothing will not see in this grand community but ha, his own and imagine especially when i look at it and knows that his age come oh god elders that are supposed to that's supposed to be wise have a lot a lot of wisdom or enough wisdom at their disposal at the one acting as children anyway it is well though for admin ellis i won't let i won't make this without him admin ellis for admin ellis i have actually criticized him and defended him as well in the past in, in some aspects why because I will though never agree with his decision to keep quiet while money was being collected without a just cause during um, Reverend Wanachuku time. Why I will never agree with him is because he acknowledged that he knew that the money was they were collecting was not for the right cause, but he kept quiet until he was instructed to do a V note against um, Wanachuku 
So that is not a virtuous um, person um, personality trait. Let me put it that way. It's not a virtuous trait. But then again, I'm this kind of person that don't castigate or bring down the virtuous efforts of some um, someone's um, you know um, virtuous efforts of someone because of their past um, lapses or shortcomings. But for the more and more good time, I will never ever agree with him, especially that he admitted that he knew he knew what was happening but kept quiet. I will never ever agree with him. It is wrong and it will always be wrong. But then again, for the present moment, from what he's doing, I can't say um, he is doing what is wrong. I can't say he's doing what is wrong. Why? Because from all indication, for the for the time even agp again will be wrong are uh, wrong at least him <coughs> stood standing against um uag is the right cause because we all know who those people are we all know everything they've thrown to us everything they have said to, said to us we've in this time we have in the time past listening to the risk and um, we have crossed at the road at the red sea the money has been shared. If December have one week to this um, disbursement would have happened, and all that, all those were lies. We saw so people, someone go to ITV and say he did not collect money and all that. He only borrowed hundred thousand naira, which is very very funny. Those things are lied. So, though he must have been using some aspects by Apostle Ken before. But now that he realized and he say he say no, I have um, seen a lot of people or I have seen a lot of time he saying and um, people are sending him threat. I say those people sending him threat messages are fools and foolish. Um, it is high time a we start to defend to to start we start to define ourselves. We should have definition of who we are and to and then be prepared to stand by it. I for me. I don't actually care about um, anybody. My only concern is truth. So if I share any relationship with someone is because I feel like what you are chasing might be virtuous or it's on virtuous um, terms or purpose. That does not mean anytime you start to do wrong or if by any time, <laughs> This concern for you, this avenue for me and you to face ourselves. Or if you turn, then it is time for me to face you. I will face you. I will fight you based on righteous cause. Because my friend stands for truth, not against it. So for everybody concerns, you should all, all be very, very careful. Because comrade influencer have no respect for deceits, manipulation, and scamming. That is um, that. Then again, um, let me talk about um, UAAG and their strategy, this and um, their foot trigger and their strategy. Like so far, so good. UAAG are those people that any agitators coming up, they will try or try to seek an avenue or um, imbibe a strategy to pull them down. We've seen it with um, uh, Madame Z, Comrade Philip, and um, Prince Temi, <clears throat> others that um, admin um, Rio, I think, um, uh, and who is if, um, admin Ellis, and a whole lot of others where um, in some senses a ghost person calling herself just lovely have to brought, bring their uh, have brought um, their pictures to um, the public that time to castigate them and all that anyway for just lovely now that she comes to my voice note i don't actually have um ways for her because i don't fight the, fight a ghost like now she's boasted many times that she have barista she's with the law she can do this she can do that but yet she's still a ghost a person of reputation a person of ability and capability don't hide 
in the forest to throw stones at others. If you are worth it, you come to light. Then come to public, show your strength. Then you will see who is who. <clears throat> because why you can never show face yourself is when you are actually wrong, when you are fighting a falsehood fight, how dare, how can you dare to show who you are? So as far as I'm concerned, Joyce Lovely is nothing because someone without name, someone without definition, someone without trees, someone that don't even believe in herself, someone that is not self-defined, is not a person. So I would not have much words for her. Why I'm actually saying this is because I've seen that um, the woman I'm going to talk about precisely doesn't um, um, tell me to pay Mrs. Said that um, sent some information that I'm um, just lovely is trying to maybe um, instigate some women to actually um, protest against her. Madam Temitope, I've come to your terms actually. You should not even have fear because when someone, when, a ju when justice wants to prevail, it prevails ag even against those people who support the evil I am I'm, I'm, I'm assess. <clears throat> Like now, we are waiting for the people that will come and protest because definitely, I've said in Nigeria before that some person actually feel that the laws in Nigeria are not working, but it is working. And when you support an evil person, when you support what is wrong, it makes you a corporate. So let those guys come and call, um, actually, um, you know, protest because it shows further, um, it shows further what is really happening. Then it shows it traces of who those people are and they show a traces of where the law or who the law should help, hold them responsible so you should not even have um, shaking about that um i've seen lots of messages um and videos from you where you have been threatened and all that mrs temi tope balogo i want to uh, encourage you that this to fight a good cause to stand for truth, it is not easy at all. It's always going to be this way. So I believe you're a strong woman because I was not forthcoming talking about you. Why? Because I was taking I was observe I was taking my time to observe if you back down. But so far, so good. Where we reach, you've actually proved prove yourself. You've actually proved your definition. So for that um for those definition you have proved so far. I want to commend you that seriously i think um for some person that don't understand when they say what man can not do woman can do better this should be um, a good example of um what such an um you know metaphor is for so madam temitope balogo i want to encourage you to continue your just cause and continue to be good because god will stay with you and then again stay blessed yeah you are not alone on this. I repeat, you are not alone on this. I, for one, will not be coming out to start making voice note always, but we are going to be there with you and we will be with you. We will try all the best we can to support you in any way we can. Continue to stay blessed and also subscribe verse in grand community. It is high time you wake up. I keep saying this, it is high time you wake up. It is time, high time to take the bull by the scrum of the neck. Thank you all and continue to stay blessed. Like I said, I am once again comprehending influencer. God bless you all.